I'm on the, the Green Tech stand and I'm with Managing Director Ian Ellis and I know Green Tech have been around for a while but these are quite exciting times for the company. Yes, we're, we're very glad to be here again. We've been here for many years um, but we see this as now as a platform where we can actually go to the next level. We're actually going to up the brand. Um, all, the, all the stand you can see here, um, the image is upped and we're ready to, ready to charge into 2023. Smashing now, it's difficult times because it is a recession on and all the rest of it. For any company that's doing well in these circumstances, credit to you. What are, what are the products that you guys focus on? For those people who don't necessarily know that much about green tech, tell me a little bit about the company. Yep. So we started off uh, many years ago doing second-hand machinery. We've then moved on to attachments and we've really specialised on golf green attachments. So a lot of our, our products actually go on to green triple mowers and that's where we've actually... Um, all our innovation and, and drive has been over the last few years. Um, and we, we're bringing on new products um, now, um, and there's, there's many things that are happening in green tech. It seems to be the golf industry over the last COVID has, has actually done not too badly, so there still has been business to, to make over the last, what, three years? Correct. We, uh, we wondered what was happening at the start of COVID, but then as soon as golf was opened up, that's when the, 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 the increase started, and we've seen that year on year since then. So we, we, we you're in a good position to know because you've been with the company for quite some time. I know you've just recently become the managing director, yeah. but you've been with the company for quite some time. Yes, um, I managed to start with this company back in 2000, so I've been here nearly 23 years. Um, and I've that seen YTS lot. when you started? <laughs> Not quite, no. Um, I did have another job before that, but yeah, started off um, and I've done a lot of the demonstrations, so I've worked my way through the company and uh, I was privileged to be um, promoted to the managing director back in July in 2022. And you're based in North Yorkshire, is that correct? Yeah, well, the, the company is in West Yorkshire. West Yorkshire. So, subtle difference, but nearly the same. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, that's, we're at Weatherby now. Now, you mentioned some new products. Can you give me a little bit more information about what you've got that's new to the market? Yep, very, very excited to uh, bring to this show is the Mega Mix, um, which is a mixing station for mixing soluble straight fertilizers. Um, so the golf courses can actually do that themselves rather than having to have uh, the expensive um, liquid concentrate. And is it new to the show or is it just something you've had out recently and are, take, are brought to the show? We, we took it on uh, late last year but we've actually done all our research and marketing and everything else and this is a launch, launch pad now, mm -hmm. um, is this show. Yeah. And any other new products? Is that the main one? Um, that's the main one. We do have a micro groomer which we launched last year, um, which has gone through. Uh, we sold an incredible amount this last last season, but we see that as a, as a new product, not for this show, but it's one of our newest products yet. And looking forward, what are your hopes for not just 2023, but as new to the post, yeah. you'll have brought a five-year plan, I'm sure. Yes. So, what are what are your aspirations for the company going yeah. forward? So, so we've we've been um, we're hoping to maybe double our turnover in the next six years. Um, and we're expanding into more markets. We're going to the um, GCSA show in a couple of weeks' time and we'll be exhibiting there and we're hoping to broaden our, our, our markets that way. And then you've got to look for dealers and all that sort of thing stateside. Correct. Yeah, that's one of the challenges, but yeah, we're, 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 we're going for it, yeah. Well, delighted to see uh, Green Tech making such a mark and thank you very much for a little bit of your time and good luck with the job going forward. Thank you very much, Scott. Thank you. Thank you. All right.